Welcome to the Saskatoon Wildlife Federation safety training video for our world-class range facilities. We're excited to have you as a new or returning member. We would like to take this opportunity to discuss a few safety rules and the appropriate range etiquette that is expected while at this facility. As a new member, you'll need to register at the Saskatoon Wildlife Federation office and clubhouse. The office is open Monday to Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., excluding holidays. Your membership is valid for one year from the date of purchase. The club can take your photo at the office and immediately provide you with a range access card to gain entry to the facilities. You may also send in a photo and membership application electronically and have your access card mailed to you. Your five-digit member number is located on the back of the card. Members are required to wear their access card in a visible location at all times while on site. Please make sure to review the information package that you will receive. It outlines the various ranges, rules, and regulations to ensure everyone's safety. Guests are welcome to use a facility only when accompanied by a member. A guest is anyone who accompanies the member into the range shooting base, either as an observer or participant. It is necessary to obtain a guest pass prior to entering any of our range facilities. They are sold in booklets for your convenience and never expire. If you have a family membership, your spouse and any children under the age of 18 do not require a guest pass. Guest passes must always be filled out correctly before entering any of our locations. It is vital to include the date on the pass. Guest privileges and the legally required insurance coverage are only valid for that specific date. It is mandatory to have your guests carry the pass on their person while at the range. If you do not have proper documentation when checked by a range officer, you will be suspended for the day and asked to leave immediately. Your access card will be disabled until you have paid a fine of $25 at the Saskatoon Federation office to cover the administrative cost. For safety reasons, we recommend a limit of two guests per member at one time. The guests must always be under the member's direct supervision. You are responsible for the actions of your guest as well as the safety of everyone else at the facility. The outdoor range offers 40, 50, 100, 200, and 300 meter ranges, as well as a multi-directional police-only range. Card readers grant access during the range operating hours, which are Monday to Saturday from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. No shooting is allowed before sunrise or after sunset, regardless of the posted range operating times. Tap your card against the reader to read in, even if the gate is already open. All members in the vehicle must individually log their card. When leaving, every member must also log out. This is a specific requirement of the RCMP Chief Firearms Office range regulations. All vehicle traffic must stay on the gravel road, park only in the designated parking areas and not on the grass. When the red flag at each range is raised, the range is active and shooting is allowed. If the red flag is lowered or not present, the range is closed and must not be used. Anyone caught using force to enter the range or willfully damaging club property or equipment will have their membership terminated and may be charged by the police. In the event of an injury or incident, a first aid kit and an automated external defibrillator, or AED, can be found on the wall just inside the public washroom access door hallway in the on-site trailer. If there is a serious accident or emergency, contact 911 and call the range managers. Their numbers are posted on the rule boards at each range along with GPS coordinates, the land location, and important safety policies. Someone will need to remain at the front gate to let emergency personnel in when they arrive. Range officers ensure the safety of all individuals on site and will ask anyone to leave if they are acting in a dangerous or disrespectful manner. ROs can be easily distinguished by their orange colored hat, range officer badge, or orange safety vest. If there is no official range officer on site and there are two or more shooters present, one shooter must always take responsibility and assume the role of the acting range officer. If you arrive at the range and other shooters are present and no official range officer can be identified, ask who is the acting range officer. You are required to follow their safety commands. If the acting RO leaves, designate a new range officer immediately.
While at the range, please abide by the following rules. 1. Members must wear appropriate eye and ear protection at all times when on the property. 2. Proper gun handling procedures must be used at all times. Actions must be open, the magazine unloaded, and the rifle placed in an upright position whenever someone is forward of the firing line. 3. Handguns are only allowed on the 40 and 50 meter ranges. Handguns are not to be fired on the 100, 200, and 300 meter ranges. Handguns must be unloaded, actions opened or holstered, and pointed at the side berm or encased whenever someone is forward of the firing line. 4. Never handle your gun when people are downrange. Stay back from the shooting area and benches. No firearms are to be taken to or from the line and handled when someone is downrange. It is mandatory to wait for everyone to return from the targets before setting up. 5. Only paper targets are allowed on the backstops provided. Metal targets can only be used under direct supervision of an official RO designated by the club. 6. Reactive targets, exploding targets, glass, cans, or items placed on the target support rails are never permitted at the range at any time. We support a family-friendly experience while at the range. The use of any offensive targets or behavior is prohibited. 7. Mid-range targets are prohibited due to the high risk of a projectile ricochet leaving the range area and endangering others. All shots must be contained within the berms. Any intentional ricochets or unaimed shots will result in an immediate loss of membership. 8. Shotgun use is restricted to slug-only ammunition at a maximum range of 50 meters. Shotgun pellet ammunition is prohibited. 9. All shooting stations must be cleaned by the shooter. This includes removing paper targets from backstops and picking up any brass, shells, or cartridge boxes to be disposed of properly. 10. Consumption of alcohol or use of drugs is prohibited before and while on the range. 11. Anyone in violation of the range safety rules will be immediately suspended. At the discretion of the Saskatoon Wildlife Federation Board of Directors, a suspended member may appeal the decision. If successful, they will be required to take a mandatory $75 range orientation course to reinstate their membership and range privileges. A full list of rules is posted at each range. These rules, along with important caliber restrictions for each range, are also found in the printed range information package or on our website. Please familiarize yourself with these rules and caliber designations to ensure the continued safety and enjoyment of everyone. If you witness a violation of the range rules, please contact the club administration or range managers immediately. Safety is everyone's responsibility. The Saskatoon Wildlife Federation rents out our ranges to several law enforcement agencies. Any range in use for police training immediately becomes a restricted area. Please be respectful and keep a considerate distance from their training exercises. We hope you enjoyed your time here at the Saskatoon Wildlife Federation at our indoor and outdoor range facilities. If you have any concerns or suggestions, please feel free to contact us. We look forward to having you as a responsible and safe member of our organization. Contact us for more information on becoming an official range officer, volunteer, mentor, or coach. Additional rules, information, and helpful tips can be found on our website.